Now that you have established some of the basics of research throughout this semester and all your different classes, we'd like to ask you to work on one more thing, and that's finding a variety of evidence. Um, a lot of times what we see students finding is facts and statistics, like you did last time in Teen Health and Wellness Database. You found definitions, you found statistics, you found um, general outlines of what people know about these health topics. That's great and that's important, but there are other types of evidence as well. For example, in social studies, you may have used um, stories or testimony from real life individuals um, or anecdotes that recount particular occurrences. Um, and you may also, in other classes, maybe in science, and what we're going to really work on today is finding some expert claims. What do experts really say about this topic? And if you add some of these expert claims, it's going to help you create a stronger product. Okay, and let me show you how. So this time, we're going to use the Gale Power Search database. Um, Gale is a company that creates databases that will search newspapers, magazines, academic journals, and I'll show you um, how to get there. So you're going to go to the Northview main page and click Media Center, and then Online Resources Search Databases. Uh, the first one right here is what we're looking for, the Gale Power Search. You're going to click Search All the Gale Databases at once. And um, instead of going straight to a keyword search, I want to show you one of the best ways to search, and that is using a subject guide search. So if you click on subject guide search, it gives you the same bar, and what you're going to do is not put a whole phrase in there, but you're going to put one subject term, one term that your project is about. So for example, if yours is about water, you could simply put in water. And I'll, I'll show you some other examples in just a second. Once you put in your subject term, it's going to tell you what are the different subject terms that Gail uses to describe articles. So you want to pick one of these, and ours is just going to be water here. You want to click subdivisions, and it's going to break down your topic into lots of smaller subtopics. Almost all of your topics, and especially the ones you're doing, are going to have one called health aspects. Let's click on that one. You see it's going to give you 317 articles that are about the health aspects of water. And that's exactly what you want. So you see that using the subject guide search takes you um, just with a few clicks to get you to something that you really need. Okay, so now I want to look at the different types of sources. It's given me magazines, academic journals, books, news, audio. I want to use magazines and newspapers because they're going to give you facts, but they're also um, newspapers and magazines often quote experts when they're um, explaining why or how something is true. So I'm going to look at those first, okay? So I'm going to click on this one because Bottled Beauty sounds like a, a possible title that I might like. Uh, but as I look through, I don't see any names or of, of experts in the field. So I'm going to go back to my search results. I'm going to keep looking. Um, a World of Hurt. Okay, this one's about um, natural pain remedies. And it does talk about water. And it says, um, mild dehydration can lower your pain threshold, say researchers in Japan. Okay, that's referencing researchers in Japan, but it's not very specific. So I think I'm still going to keep looking. Back to search results. And I'm going to keep looking for titles that look good. No, no, no. Maybe Waterworks or All Natural Energizers. Let me try that one. Okay. And as I look through here, it says put down that can of Red Bull. Okay, this seems related. Energy drinks have the potential to do real damage over time. Okay, so Keith Cantor. Okay, so this guy is good. Green tea, coconut water. Um, coconut water could be something that I could use in my in my topic um, and water okay I could use this one talks about um, Dr. Cantor and so as I'm taking notes I could include not only the information about coconut water and water but also um, recommends Dr. Cantor who is a nutritionist and author. So I'm going to include that in my notes. Remember, when you are citing sources in a Gale article, it, um, it's really easy to work with, uh, with EasyBibs. So if you click Citation Tools right here, 
it's going to go right to EasyBib, and as long as you're logged in, it's going to put you in the most recent project that you've been using. So you see it already has put my source right in there. Now I can go to my notebook, and I can take some notes. Um, I can choose it from here. I'm going to call this water and coconut water as my title. I'm going to put the um, put maybe the quote that I want in here and I'm also going to um, put in the information about Dr. Cantor. So um, I'm going to say that he has recommended these things. It seems like everything in this article has really come from here. Um, recommended by Dr. Keith Cantor's. Um, and then I'm going to put it in my own words and go from there. Okay? So that's one example. Um, let me just show you another tool that is helpful when you're subject guide searching. So let's say I was wanting to search for um, sports drinks like Gatorade. I could search for that. Sometimes when you put a term in, it's going to say see another topic, so see energy drinks. Okay, so I could look at that, click subdivisions as I did before, look for that health aspect. And as I look through here, I see this one kind of mentions Red Bull. And that's not really the energy drink I want. So I can use this search within results right here. And I can put in Gatorade and see if I get something there. Okay, so now I'm finding what I want here. So I'm going to check this one. And I see that in this one, not only is there an assistant professor of nutrition mentioned, but also some well-known runners, track champions, etc. And those would all be... Um, expert claims that I could quote. And you want to make sure, again, to include the claim plus the signal phrase with the expert's credentials, why, they, why they're important. All right.